This is the second time for me to have breast cancer. So the diagnosis wasn't totally uh, surprising. Since they already done the deep flap, then we had to look at what was the alternative. And so the alternative was to do the gluteal flap. I chose an immediate reconstruction because it just made sense to while you're in there doing the surgery of the mastectomy, why not go ahead and do the reconstructive at the same time. I have a wonderful oncologist who, when it came time to say, what do we do about surgery, I asked her and she immediately said, you need to go to PRMA. Here at PRMA, we are able to perform a wide variety of tissue transplant reconstruction techniques and options. We're certainly known for the DIEP flap or the, the deep flap, as we say. However, we frequently bring into play other tissue reconstruction options. So in particular, the gluteal flap. The gluteal flap can be taken from the upper uh, buttock or flank area, which we call the superior gluteal flap, or it can be taken from the lower gluteal area, we call the inferior. So it's S-gap and I-gap. Most commonly, I would perform the S-gap operation, the upper gluteal area. Even in a thin person, there's typically enough tissue that can give us some good volume for a, a breast reconstruction. Today I feel good. I let things be in the past and look forward. I'm very pleased with the results of the procedure. It's a natural looking breast, it feels natural. I met with Dr. Pisano afterwards and he actually commented that it was the best results that he had seen um, through the gluteal flap. The PRMA staff have been really good to work with. The consultation with Dr. Pisano, he answered all my questions. The whole experience with that group has been very positive for me. Many of our patients are coming to our practice because the routine options are not available. So we in the practice are expert at bringing into play a variety of other areas of the body to give us tissue to do the reconstruction.